Alrighty, hello, 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 hello everybody, and welcome back to Armored Core Fires Rubicon. So, as a YouTuber, I learned something. Unfortunately, my first video is like two hours and some odd minutes long, so it took a while to render it, and then it's going to take a while to upload it on YouTube. But hopefully it looks absolutely freaking gorgeous, because I up upgraded the bitrate for y'all. Um, so... That will probably unfortunately come out a little bit later than I expected. However, I'm going to slam back-to-back -back videos on that day, so I'll be relatively caught up to where I would be if the first video were to upload on the day of launch like I wanted it to. But, anyway, enough gagging of the lolly. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and look at the arena. So, <laughs> sorry if you hear that in the background. My roommate is also playing this. Um... Okay, I'm guessing the ranks that go lower in number are more expensive. And these are OS chips that I'd really like to get my hands on. Uh, Coral-based drugs? Oh no, he's an addict. Convinced himself he's a demigod. Alright, well, let's, uh, let's do this virtual simulation. Welcome to the Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program. First subject, AC. Mad Stomp. Call sign, Invincible Rummy. Okay. Commencing evaluation. Okay. Here we go. Main system. Activating See if I get my PP schwacked. Did he just try to swing at me? Oh. Oh, I almost missed him. Or I almost got him. Doink. That wasn't too bad. He's a little destroyed. slow. Concluding and, uh, evaluation. We are built well for speed. I am getting a little tired of our main gun ricocheting off of everything in the world. So I'll probably try to get a regular rifle that can... Ooh, OST chips. And we got AC data. I guess that means we can build his AC if we want to. But yeah, I'm getting a little tired of our machine gun just kind of bouncing off everything. Let's see what we got in terms of a main weapon. The main machine gun's awesome for like really crappy low level MTs but oh okay sorry about that game kind of bugged out again uh, but ah, that was my previous issue is our generator isn't able to put out enough stuffs um, let me look at the part shop real quick yeah that energy output is absolutely freaking outstanding but it's so expensive we're almost there I think we need to do an actual main mission to be able to grab that because these arena missions don't give a whole ton. But let's go to OS tuning. So, unlock the ability to perform a boost kick. Boost kicks hit with heavy impact by combining the speed of an assault boost with sheer weight of the AC. We don't have a whole lot of weight. A weapons bay. Unlock the weapons bay feature of the AC shoulders, allowing shoulders to be replaced with additional hand weapons oh so I can literally switch out my weapons I don't know I kind of like our shoulder mounted uh, things right now unlocks the ability to sortie when AC is overburdened and to manually purge weapons purging weapons reduces weight load and improves speed Oh, the old Armored Core experience. Quick turns. Assault armor. Nice, we can get some nice active protection. We can do more kinetic damage. More, more melee weapons damage. 
access speed. Okay, I think I'll grab the boost kick and try it out on this next arena. Nice, we got a little, little Chivo for that. We already verified. Oh, so we can fight again, but get less money and no OS upgrades. Go ahead and go for this guy. <clears throat> Looks like a samurai. Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program, number 28. Rank F. Kind of does look like a same. Subject right? AC. Burn pickaxe. Call sign. Index Dunham. Commencing evaluation. It's a big ass cannon he's got there on his left arm. Main system. Activating combat mode. Well, right out of the gate, shall we? Oh my gosh, I'm a genius, hold up. I don't think I remember the controls for it, which is absolutely outstanding. Oh, there we go, okay. Nice. Okay, I'm just get in the groove, just get in the groove. Got him. Wasn't too bad. Lost a bit too much health though. Target destroyed. Oh, we don't have any repair kits. Including evaluation. Well done. That's not very good. Verifiable. I wonder how far the arena goes. Does it just keep giving me more and more people the more I kill? that's the case, we'll do one last arena person and we'll hop on to the missions. Okay, cool. No, no. <clears throat> so, gun six. I can uh, kill. I can kill gun six. Oh, man. Arena Literally woke up. Aptitude oh. evaluation program. Number 27, rank F. Final evaluation. Oh, until I'm upgraded. Yeah, I literally Subject woke up today. Gun six, red. I don't know, it's like immediately doing our record. Commencing evaluation. It's a real sexy AC too. Main system. Activating combat mode. Oh, I remember this map. Sonny, you can get close. Oh, gosh. He's above me. <laughs> of course, he'd hit me with that. Oh, 
Ooh. Got him. Barely. Freaking hooligan. This concludes F rank evaluation. Well done. Cannons don't. I don't do too well with cannons. I don't know why, but they seem to be ridiculously accurate in the middle of the air and also to my face. Okay, gun six taken care of. Congratulations, you have surpassed rank F. We are glad to oversee your development as a mercenary. All mind exists for all mercenaries. Okay, so we're rank. Uh, okay. All right, well, that's all we got. I'm going to look a little bit more at our OS and see if there's anything else that's pretty cool that I would want. I'll be right back, so I don't waste anyone's time. Okay, so pretty much what I grabbed is the quick turn, because I really like that. I like being fast. Assault armor. Apparently this uh, creates a pulse explosion centered around the AC, canceling out incoming enemy fire and creating a damage area of effect shockwave. So if I am able to reach my pinky over to the control in R and the time it takes for a cannon to collide with my face hole. Then I got some melee damage upgrades. So... That's all I got for now. Um, okay, here's the assault armor that we're grabbing. Surprisingly, that doesn't put a load on our AC. And I will try to remember those keys. Alright, let's go on a mission. Let's read some combat logs. Got a job for you, 621. One of the Balaam companies has put in a request. Attention, Gun 13 Raven. This request comes from our affiliate Dafung. We're conducting an investigation into the Vespers, Archibus's augmented human squad. Currently, our focus is on their fourth squad leader, V4 Rusty. Sweep the route Rusty took during Operation Wall Climber and retrieve combat logs from the wrecks he left on his way in. The wall is now under Archibus's control. They stationed their MT squads there for the Coral Survey. As such, he'll be targeting the brief window where their main force is deployed elsewhere. Keep an eye on the time and retrieve as many logs as you can. That concludes the briefing. Sorry, sir. We expect prompt results, Gun 13. All right, well, apparently we're Raven, Gun 13. Six, two, one. You should be used to Rubicon by now. Time to take a break from shooting up the place. No? Why does he not want me shooting people? I'm confused, Walter. What do you want from me? Father, please. I just want that new generator. I'll be able to do... uh quite a lot more. I think I'll have to upgrade my legs though. Because I think we're getting close to our weight limit for our AC. Commence mission. What? Search the nearby racks for combat logs recording engagements with V4 Rusty. That's what we're looking for, 621. I'll analyze it on my end. Oh. The log indicates that the FCS was operating at the maximum capacity and it was still unable to track the enemy was completely overwhelmed by rusty speed and was clearly a one-sided engagement. This gives us some more insight about V4 skills. Ah, dang, I missed. Analyzing Borg. Okay, text data was extracted from the wreck. Appears to be auto transcribed for a voice log recording it by an off duty pilot. The well we found in Gallia is going to dry up sooner than later. We can't just harvest as much coral as we used to, and what little we got, the core squeezed out of us. 
They know we needed to raise mealworms. They know more children must... How many more children must we watch start? Some more evidence on what the coral situation looks like. What? Boy. Why is it timed? I'm scared. Where's... There's another one right I have one expansion. Jesus, all right, you guys don't have to do all that. Yeesh, you hooligans. That makes three logs. Video record extracted from a wreck. Uh, to discern the ability of Rusty's AC Steel Haze. The Steel Haze appears to be assembled from a Schneider high mobility frame with weapons that allow for swift, agile action. Notably, Rusty appears to favor kinetic weaponry that Vesper members would not normally use. This is useful. We've got visuals on V4's AC assembly. Can you kill the tetrapod? That's scary. Oh. Com records extracted from a record. This appears to be a conversation between allies prior to the start of the mission. We can't beat the top Vespers. We're as good as dead. At least Z is off duty. She's the Liberation Front's little sister. Uh, she doesn't deserve to be out here on the battlefield. She can still love and be loved, have a family. That's pretty cool. Oh, and it used up the expansion. Alright. Um, just wanted to see what it was like. Big ol' artillery can. Video record extracted from a wreck contains leftover data from the attempt to communicate with Rusty during combat. How could you? I, I know who you are. I've seen Uncle's, uncle's fly, files. At least tell me why. Very interesting. This could be worth something. Yeah, perhaps. Is that everything? Oh, wait, no, there's stuff down here. Alright, well. Keep an eye on the clock. Either avoid combat or make it quick. I'm trying, man. Analyzing. Oh, he didn't want me to shoot anybody. Allow one to examine the commands received by craft prior to destruction. No data regarding offensive or evasive maneuvers detected. It appears that the pilot of his craft immediately pulled the eject sequence lever at the start of the operation. Nothing we can sell here. Oh, yeah. You, AC pilot, you're no comrade of ours, are you? Ooh. Wait, you, you killed them all. I didn't do nothing. Just hold us up if you engage her. She comes before everything else. Ooh. Comms extracted from the right contain leftover data from an attempt to intercept Rusty's encrypted line. When me comes, Yuring will technology Elcano. You must hidden then. Oh, dang, I keep missing. You're actually not too hard, are you? I'd like to kill you before the mission's over. Oh, gosh. Gotcha. Wrap it up. Archibus's main force will be here any minute now. We've okay. got enough logs to satisfy the request. That's it for this job, 621. Return to base. We'll do. Almost didn't kill her in time. 
Alright. That wasn't too bad. Alright. Oh, I forget ammo cost money. <laughs> what am I doing? Is that Long Hunt? Give me OS stuff? Obtain 10 data logs. Okay. Oh, another cutscene. Long time no see, Walter. Looking good for a change. I see you've got a new augmented human. What happened to 617 and the rest? Their jobs. They did what it took to get us here. Huh. So how's the newcomer doing? Adequately. But Gen 4 augmentation can be unstable. We need to choose our battles. How's things on your end? I found the data our friends left behind. There's something promising in the watch point. I thought we were here just to make money. What's going on, man? Two new messages. Go 13 Raven! Bagged us some decent intel on V4. Report this to Commander Michigan. Additionally, I'll introduce myself. Gun 6 Red. But you can call me Sir. Privileged to be among Balaam's best, even if I am stuck whipping you independence into shape. Believe you me, I'm gonna put you to work. Okay. So they're part of the corporation? I thought they were just independence. Got a job for you, 62. Front. You'll see when you check the briefing. Okay. Is it from you, Dad? AC design, assembly. We got some new arms, didn't we? Yeah. So, turn it too bad. They add a bit of weight. Yeah, they add quite a bit of weight. Do I have enough for that generator? I do. It's going to cost all of my money. But we're kind of stuck at a point where we can't do anything. Wait, hold on. Where, where is my generator? Generator. There it is. Yeah. Oof. Give it to me. I want... This. Current load. Yeah, it looks like we're approaching our load limit here. But we should be able to slap on our sword that does a ton more damage we are like literally so close to our load max load there overburdened a laser handgun <clears throat> anything else will make us kind of get too close to our load limit unfortunately um It reduces weight and energy load, but they're kind of crappy boosters. Okay, we'll have to probably focus on getting better legs. But we now have the new sword. And I am very interested to see what that does to an enemy's uh, AC. Go ahead and move on to the watch point. <clears throat> this is a rather personal request from a friend of mine. It concerns a certain facility, a watch point. Once, it regulated the underground flow of coral. Now, it serves to monitor the dormant veins. I want you to attack it. Your objective will be to destroy the sensor valve at its core. The watch point is kept secure by SG, the planetside PCA force, which means it's too hot for the corporations to be seen there. In other words, we're flying strictly solo on this one. You know, it'd be pretty cool if we didn't get paid by this, just to kind of show, like, some realism. Oh, this concludes the chapter. This is definitely a boss fight. You'll be going in under cover of darkness. Be ready for anything. Interesting. I wonder how many chapters there are. Here we go with Flanker. 
you might see a, a weird cut in the video if I die quite a lot by this definite boss battle that we're about to have. Just so I don't waste anyone's time from how many times I'm getting turned into a Dark Souls paste. Oh, worry. this is a not even the PCA would anticipate a solo independent mercenary. This is a helicopter. Or I'm get a in there and get to work. Or at least I'm loaded into a helicopter. Main system activating combat mode. Alright, those big ass guns are kinda scary. Kick it face. Nice. Confirmed. Enemy squad destroyed. Move on to the next area. Alright. Had to take a lot of unnecessary damage there. Need to be careful. Where did that AC come from? What happened to the patrol squad? Code 1 All units deploy for combat. They're exposed to snipers from all quarters. Keep moving or they'll shoot you down. Ooh. your marker data. Proceed in the direction indicated. One repair kit remaining. I am aware of the one repair kit. Do you see that? Oh, That's this is the boss fight. Points control center. The target's inside. Make your way in. Pretty sure I saw this boss fight from gameplay video. <laughs> Let me get close. Oh my gosh. Your bullshit cannon. Oh, I freaking hate that cannon. Gosh, the stun. Me and him are just constantly trying to kick each other in the face. Ah, oh, Sully, you son of a gun. I hate your freaking cannon so much.
Come on, come on, stop. I hate that freaking cannon, yes. To work. Control center and destroy the target. Okay. Sounds good. Almost killed me, son of a gun. I need a resupply, Walter. Can you help a brother out? Oh, tiny little Tonka truck. It's adorable. This is a resupply point. Ah, bless. Bless, bless, bless. Alright, very good. I don't even think I even... I don't even think I used my expansion either. Where am I going? Down? This also seems like another boss fight. Okay. Why did they resupply me? Good job. Something tells me we are not done here. Wait, no. Six two one, get out of there. Oof, that can't have been good for my face. Now. 
That cheeky cannon, man. Oh, I'm out of juice. I was like, why am I not going, going? He dodged that. He straight up dodged that. thing was a monster. Raven. You need rest. But first a warning. Coral surge you were swept up in? That was just a glimpse. A premonition of the storm of flame that will burn Rubicon. Oh my gosh, that was the hardest freaking boss ever. I'll, I'll cut it so you don't see me die and die again, but that was a real pain in the ass. Unfortunately, I'm the better for it. Of mine sent me this observational data. Look, 621. The localized coral explosion caused by the surge has a certain directionality. Headed straight for the central ice field across the Alien Ocean. Like a flock of birds or a school of fish, Coral loves company. Which means somewhere in the ice field, there's a huge mass of coral lying dormant. You said you could hear a strange voice in your head. That's a common side effect of old gen augmentation. Could also be from getting caught in that coral surge. Don't let it bother you. Raven. The coral explosion completely vaporized northwestern Balius's Bay Area. And even yet, compared to the fires of Ibis, that explosion was hardly a spark. Raven, I have a favor to ask. Let me remain in contact with you until we reach the Coral Convergence. I have to see where they're taking us. How this struggle over the Coral ends. I must, as a Rubiconian. Holy wow, Batman. Oh, man. Augment 
Detected human, C4621, entering standard mode. Two new messages. about us. Raven, I see your handler is away on business for now. About that trip to the ice field, we've received a job from Balin already. Let's take a look, shall we? I feel emotionally and mentally drained. for RB23, call sign Raven. Your records have been updated. E-rank virtual encounters are now available in the arena. We invite you to hone your technique. Thanks. I feel like I've done a lot of that on that one boss alone. New mercenary data to the arena. Okay, some more parts. We got some money, so let's see what we can do. We'll be overburdened if we got that. I don't know, a shotgun? Honestly, that dude's shotgun was absolutely devastating. Iridium grenade launcher. Okay, I don't think I need a nade launcher, a laser rifle, or a laser shotgun. I don't need anything that I need to charge and then fire. It'll take my mech a little bit to recover from that. This pulse gun, though. And we just have a straight up missile launcher. I'm going to give the pulse going to try. Uh, oh, that don't make it too heavy. I'm going to give the pulse going to try. And it decreases weight. Grenade. Laser cannon. I could get two laser cannons. I'm honestly kind of thinking of getting two laser cannons. Mostly because... Oh, no, I can't afford it. Just having two laser cannons to absolutely devastate people would be great. Is there anything I can introduce with weight? Dual missile launcher. Two cell missile launcher developed. Targets in pincer trajectory. Limited evasion options. This model is suitable for lightweight builds and is capable of multi-lock. Uh, I kind of want to reduce the burden of my, my mech. I need to go for better legs. Reduces the weight, increases our load. Gosh, those are expensive. Those are some pretty good legs I really want. I will have to do something about that. We got, don't have better boosters. We have better targeting computers. I will grab. And our generators are still the same. Alright, cool. There was something I missed. Sorry, hold on, let me... Oh, a pile bunker! Dang, that does a lot of damage! I really want that. We're gonna have to reduce weight, though. Hmm. We'll sting like a bee. Float like a butterfly. That could reduce weight. I'm always going to try to reduce our weight. The best of my ability. Let's go ahead and put that new fire control chip in. That'll help us aim a little better. Oh, did I... I think I got something, didn't I? Ah, the microwave gun. Let's see how that works for us. All right, to the arena with us. I'll do a few of these before I call it a mission. I, I honestly don't even know how long the video has been going since I died so much. 
If you're curious, I have two hours worth of recording right now, and I think I started dying a lot around like the Arena Combat 30 minute Aptitude mark. Evaluation Program number 26, entering rank E. It's a sexy looking AC. Subject AC, bitter promise. Call sign Nozark. Nozark? That says Nozak. Commencing evaluation. All right, let's do this. Wow, he's really close in the distance, isn't he? Ooh, don't like those. Wow, I'm really liking this microwave. He's getting close. Come on, just give up. Just give up. Microwave. Oh, it overheats. Interesting. Well done. And it has limited ammo. That's not what I expected. All right, verifiable. Kick that dude's ass. Cool, got the emblem. That is a pretty sick emblem, not gonna lie. Back to the next arena. Uh, already verified, let's go for you. Wait, no. For a second I thought I was fighting me. The flank and spank, man. The flank and spank. Hmm. I am going to be sad whenever I switch out our legs Arena and we're not going to have those weird jointed, double jointed legs. Rank e. Subject AC. Infection. Call sign V6. Mater link. I see it's a lot of microwaves. Commencing evaluation. That's scary. Main system. Activating combat mode. This freaking shield cheater. We are able to hit more often with our shoulder mounted now since we got that fire control system upgrade. I don't think this microwave ricochets either, which is something I, I'm quite enjoying about it. Let's do some OS tuning. You can get a weapons bay. I'm not too curious about that or too interested in that. Assault armor. Heck yeah. I do enjoy that assault armor. It's not too bad. That takes everything. All right, back to the arena. The next person, little Z. Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program, number 24, rank E. Did I know how to kill this person? Subject AC, UAU, call sign, little Z. -E. Little Z. -y. Commencing evaluation. All right, let's do this. As long as they're not fast. Activating combat mode. It's like my AC's one saving grace is fast as heck, boy. Whoa. 
lot of them are getting shields. Hunched over forward, leaning AC look. Very sleek. Very nice. Okay, more OS chips. For the hot shit, I talk about the assault armor. I sure don't use it a whole lot, do I? Alright, and on to the next arena. Uh, Swinburne. This guy looks fast, unfortunately. Which we will not re maintain a competitive edge. Evaluation program. Number 23. Rank E. Final evaluation. Subject AC. Guidance. Call sign V7 Swinburne. Right in the brains. Evaluation. This looks like a sexy AC too. Main system. Activating combat mode. Alright, fire those jets up. Let's go. Right in the face hole. And they're pretty good at dodge at my general shots. destroyed me. He's got weird melee weapons. I'm sad by the animation that he just dodged that. Got him. With the misses. Target destroyed. It's not a bad looking AC, this man. E -rank evaluation. Well done. This game is seriously like Dark Souls. It's dying left, right, and center. Some nice OST shit. Chips. Alright. Incoming cars. Congratulations. You have surpassed rank E. We are glad to oversee your development as a mercenary. All mind exists for all mercenaries. Okay. And Get some more assault armor, additional assault armor charges, and that will put us out of good stuff. Some more melee damage would be awesome, because that's kind of like my ace, or my, my uh, flanker here. But I think I'll go ahead and call it here. 
Thank you all for joining. I hope you're enjoying. And in the next one, we're going to continue on our merry way with our missions. Bye, everybody.